Hi guys, this is Zia Maliki from Information Technology. In this tutorial, I will be showing you how to clean up your C drive in Windows 10 without using any third-party software. This process not only provides you more space to work with, but it also speeds up the overall performance of the Windows. I'm using Windows 10 for this purpose, but it works the same way for Windows 7 or 8. Let's jump right into it. The first approach is to clean up all Windows temporary files. These are the files created by the operating system during the normal course of running. Some temporary files are created by applications for backup processes. Some of these files are left behind when the task is completed, which leads to the wastage of disk space. To get rid of these redundant files, we will be running three simple commands to review their location using the run command box. To do that, go to your Windows search and type run, then click on the run application. Type in the command temp as shown on the screen and hit enter. This folder will pop up with a bunch of files you probably don't know. Press Ctrl A to select them all. Hold down the shift key and press the delete key to permanently remove them. If you get a message saying some files cannot be deleted, just click on this checkbox and click escape to continue the process. The second command is a bit similar to the first one. This time we will place it between two percentage signs. Let's go back to the run command box and type in percentage temp percentage and hit enter. Now you will see another folder pop up with a set of weird files and folders inside. As we did before, let's press Ctrl A to select all, hold down the shift key and press the delete key button to permanently delete or remove them. And let's go to the run command box for the third time and type free page as shown on the screen and hit enter. Click on continue. Once again you will see another folder like this that contains unknown files. Select all by pressing the Ctrl A shortcut and hit delete to remove them all. Removing all of that out of our way, our next action would be to defragment and optimize our C drive. This process will rearrange the files and data, where files or file segments will be placed next to each other under the storage locations. This will increase access to files and folders. This will increase the speed of your windows by a lot. To open the defragmentation tool, press the windows button on your keyboard and type defrag as shown on the top of the screen. Click on Defragment and Optimize Drives from the search result. Select the C drive from the windows and click Optimize. Wait for the process to complete. The next step is to do a disk cleanup. This is another way of removing unnecessary or redundant files and freeing up disk space in windows. To run this process, go to the windows search and type disk cleanup. And then click on disk cleanup from the result. In the first screen, it will show you that the C drive is selected as the drive to be cleaned up. Press OK and wait for the process to complete. After the completion, you will get a windows like this with a list of files and folders that you can delete to free up your disk space. Select all the files by checking the boxes next to them and then click on clean up system files and wait for the process to complete. Check all the boxes and hit OK and delete the files. This will take a while depending on how much you have to clean up, so you have to wait for some time. Finally, let's try to locate some heavy files that might have been saved in some folders that we no longer remember and no longer need them. Sometimes we download some files or application for future use. We often forget to delete such files and gradually they get lost among other files and folders from us. These redundant files in our application occupy our disk space. The next step we are going to apply will help us reveal these files in applications. From there, we can choose to delete or skip them. Open the file explorer by hitting the Windows plus E key. Double click on C drive. On this folder, go to the search bar, which is on the right top corner of the window. And type size colon gigantic, as shown on the screen. This will scan your C drive for all files larger than 1 to 8 MB. The process might take a while depending on how much it has to scan. So here we have all the files larger than 1 to 8 MB. 
From here, I will select all unwanted files and delete them. Always remember to empty the recycle bin after doing such process. Otherwise, the disk space will still be occupied. An additional step would be to uninstall all unwanted programs and applications you have installed. To do that, you need to go to the search and type add or remove programs. Click on add or remove program from the search. You can scroll down for any unwanted program you no longer need. Click on the program and hit uninstall to remove it. One last tip for today's tutorial is to perform this process once in a while depending on how much you use your PC and the kind of programs you are running on your PC. By doing so you will get rid of redundant files and folders in order to free up your disk space. Give this video a thumbs up if you found it useful and share with anyone you think might want to see. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for notifications for future information technology support like this one. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.